Hey guys, it's Taylor. Welcome back to my channel. Um, this feels really weird. I haven't talked to a camera in so, so long. I went from making, like, I'd be in high school making videos for TV productions and on a YouTube channel, so I was literally always, like, talking to a camera. And I haven't made a YouTube video since my birthday, I think. I took a break. Um, I just kind of wasn't feeling inspired or wanting to make YouTube videos anymore. Um, but now I have a new reason. So as you probably read by the title or figured out, or if you follow me on other social media because I have been active over there, I got engaged back in December. I don't mind the self tan hands, but today I'm actually going wedding dress shopping and I feel like this would be a fun way to bring back the videos. So I think I'm just gonna make like a wedding series on here and kind of just going over all of my planning, what I'm doing, all that fun stuff. I have made some TikToks as well if you're like into like the whole TikTok world. I'm very obsessed with TikTok. Um, but right now I'm actually in class on Zoom. I just showered. I'm going to do my makeup, blow out my hair and stuff, and then we're gonna head over to David's Bridal today. I don't obviously plan on getting a dress at all, especially since I'm going to David's Bridal. Not that there's anything wrong with David's Bridal, but it's not the place that I wanna get my dress from. There's like a certain place I wanna go, but I wanna try them on just to see kind of like what style I like best on like my chest and like everything. So we're just gonna do that for fun today, and I'm super excited, but I'm gonna go start getting ready, and let's do it. How to feel like the prettiest girl in the room. <laughs> I've been using these rollers ever since I saw them on TikTok to do like the front pieces, especially because I got like curtain bangs kind of. I don't know if they're curtain bangs, they've kind of grown out a little bit, but I love when I like blow dry my hair and I like, put these in for like 30 minutes and I take it out. She's like super pretty. So I'm just seeing like this, did my makeup and I'm gonna go pick an outfit. My Zoom class just ended. And if I have time before I have to leave, maybe I'll do like a quick update and like talk about my engagement and stuff like that. For those of you who've been wondering where I've been, if you don't follow me on any of those other social medias, which if you don't, my Instagram, like TikTok and stuff will be down in the description box where I post like way more often. So yeah, I'm gonna go pick on an outfit. I don't even know if it's hot outside. I mean, it's Florida, so probably it is. And for any of you who have missed out on Percy action, she's still as cute as ever. <laughs> Hey guys, so it has been <laughs> quite a few hours since I last talked to you. I actually ran out of time. I had to run out of the house before I went dress shopping, but I actually said yes to my dress today. So I will include um, a few pictures, I think, maybe from today. I don't know how much I wanna put in. Obviously, any pictures of a dress that I put in here are not the dresses that I picked. Um, I just wanna include like some way I tried on just to, like be able to look back on. I think I might make a TikTok, like one of those rating the dresses that I tried on but did I um, I think that'd be fun but I figured now would be a good time to kind of talk about um, my engagement and just update you guys and everything since I haven't been on here since I got engaged and kind of talking about like where I plan on going forward here on YouTube and like what I plan on posting and okay I guess we can just start with um, some backstory so I got um, engaged back in December um, and it was super amazing I got engaged in a st. Augustine I have I keep saying TikTok, but like I really have been into TikTok, so I've been documenting a lot on there so I do have my engagement like the day in my life on my TikTok because we were going to St. Augustine for a little trip and then we ended up getting engaged so I did have some footage from that if you guys want to go see that um, yeah so I didn't actually start wedding planning until this month March it's almost April but March so from December until then I really just kind of was like yeah I'm engaged and it's exciting but I didn't start wedding planning yet because I wasn't even sure when we were gonna get married or anything yet so I really wanted to take some time and like decide and not just like jump into it and get like overwhelmed or excited and like make impulse decisions kind of very impulsive so <laughs> there's that so we picked December 2022 so we're a year and eight months out I think um which is exciting it's starting to like fly by a little bit because at first I was like obviously we got married in December so when we decided we we're like oh we have two years like that's so long and even though it's only been a few months it's like you realize how much you have to plan and decide on and all this stuff and you're like okay maybe two years is not that long because it is a lot of freaking work 
but I'm also having so much fun doing it. So, so I am actually gonna um, insert any clips or videos I've gotten so far as well into this vlog, just kind of as like my first video of my wedding series, because obviously I didn't plan on doing a wedding series while I was like booking my venue and stuff. I wish I would have so I can get more footage for you guys, but here on going out, I will do more. So I have booked my venue. I booked my venue about three weeks ago. So once we got the venue booked, we officially had our date locked in, saved, and then we can make our save the dates, which I also already made. Um, and I have some montage footage of that I can definitely do. So I was making a TikTok while making those. Then I moved on to my bridesmaids boxes, which I have asked that, like made them and then gave them to them already, which was super fun as well. Also made a TikTok on those. Um, and yeah, so I still have to do like my flower girl boxes, my ring bearer boxes, and then I'm probably gonna help Zeke with his groomsman proposals because you know, boys are just boys. Um, so obviously those will be in a future YouTube video. So that's something to look forward to. Um, but making my bachelor, my bachelorette, my bridesmaid boxes was so, so much fun. I had so much fun with that. I also bought like a cricket and stuff. My room is really messy, but I'm gonna flip this around really quickly. I have over here is my takeout from tonight, but I bought a cricket as you can see right there and I've been using it. And then I have this whole box on the floor is literally all just wedding stuff that I've been accumulating accumulating and using and stuff so yeah then actually two nights ago we, we booked our photographer that was something that was like really important to me because I really wanted to find someone that did the exact style of photos that I wanted and I also kind of wanted to find someone who had already shot at the venue I booked because then I can like almost see it come to life and like see if she'd actually be able to do the shots that I want to do and luckily I found someone we fell in love with her we did a zoom call this past weekend and put our deposit down on her so we have our venue and our photographer set and good to go but yeah I'm actually right now just doing some homework it's Monday night um I got some packages and I can show you guys if you were wanting to see some stuff and I probably have some wedding stuff I can show as well. And at the end of this vlog, I'll put a montage of me making my bridesmaids boxes and my save the dates, like whatever footage I have from those. And then again, like the full videos will be on my TikTok. And then from here on out, all my videos will be more structured because I'm actually planning on vlogging and I won't have to be using like random footage that's on my phone. Don't mind my room, it's super messy. I have to get to cleaning it. I've just been very busy. But one of the packages I got, so cute. They put my name on here and they put female on the other side but I got some goodies and it came in this cute little wrapping paper tissue paper so this is the brand if you want to check them out I saw it on TikTok and it blew up but um yeah so if you want to check them out check them out on Etsy and I got some stickers first I got this little butterfly sticker which I don't know if I ordered that or if they just gave that to me but I think I definitely ordered this little rainbow and it says the storm will pass. I love that. And as you can tell, it definitely fits my laptop. And then I got this sticker for one of my best friends, Taylor, because she loves plants and it says you grow girl. So I got those three stickers, but the main thing that I got, I was actually just using for my coffee. So it doesn't look as cute and as aesthetically pleasing, but it is this glass that says good morning. If you can see it with a little rainbow and it is a beer glass, but I bought it for coffee. So cute and love that it's actually kind of funny because i literally ordered that i think like three days before i ended up placing an order or buying my cricket and i definitely could have made that with my cricket but at the same point i love supporting small businesses so i don't even care that i could have made it myself because why not and the other package i got was actually from toluca swim which is whitney simmons new swim line first of all look at this bag that it came in it's like a high quality like reusable bag like i definitely would use that like for just like traveling to put like your dirty laundry and like undergarments and stuff or like a bathing suit bag i really like it all i got was a top there was a lot of stuff i wanted to get but i wanted to try out at least one thing to see kind of where my sizing was at so i'm gonna show you guys real quick okay so this is the angelina top in eucalyptus kind of hard to show laying down but obviously i will be trying it on sometime and putting on my instagram story i just think it's really really cute um it was definitely very expensive but i figured i really need like a good investment bikini that's like really really good quality because obviously i have a bunch of like she and bathing suits and stuff like that 
but having a bigger chest you know sometimes you need a bathing suit that's really gonna hold you in if i'm going on like kind of like if i want to go swimming in the ocean or something like that where you need more of that support um and yeah obviously i also want to have a like tropical bachelorette party so i also wanted to like order some bikinis for that and i'm very excited about this it's such a pretty color i'm obsessed with sage green right now and that is that honestly though i think i'm gonna end up this vlog right here and then i'll add in those clips um at the end of this clip because i don't want this to be too too long because i know it's a lot of me talking kind of catching up with you guys explaining where i'm at explaining what i'm doing so feel free to leave me literally any comments of any type of like wedding or military girlfriend fiance wife whatever how to plan a wedding in the military stuff like that um in the comments below because i am back and ready to make some wedding videos and other videos obviously i'll still make like my you know daily vlog stuff like that so it um yeah i don't even know how to end a youtube video anymore so thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next video two more of my bridesmaids today to be my bridesmaids today